I believe that, and this is a dangerous idea, that actually what is going to make you irrelevant is lack of agency, which is the lack of actually putting in the work. It's interesting, like over the last number of weeks, I've been doing a lot of keynotes to um, a lot of folks that are in like knowledge work, whether they're accountants or consultants, um, lawyers, and what amazes me is the fact that when it comes to generative AI, that they haven't even tried it. Mm. Like, we're kind of like a year into this yep. thing. Yep. And it's November. This this thing can, kind of popped off last year in November, December. And you haven't tried it yet. And you're in knowledge work. And it... Bl- it always blows it it always blows me away but then it doesn't because at the end of the day i know that people whether they're fearful they're lazy they don't understand it whatever it might be there's just a complete lack of agency and you will see this at the highest of levels people that are super professional they they they're, they're super senior in their particular role they have a lack of agency when it comes to their future and i believe that if you are not in the mud experimenting and playing Agreed. and trying things out yep. you will be completely and utterly irrelevant there is no excuse if you are in any knowledge work not to be invested in the next paradigm shift like it was the microchip the internet and this it's going to be ai I always find it interesting that people like don't want to experiment, but also I feel like that's what makes the world fun. It's like it allows for like someone else to overpass someone or overtake someone. Yeah. Cause they're going to be the ones that experiment. Right. Right now I'm on a, I mean, so are you cause I've seen you using it the last like two months. I've been on a huge Hey Gen kick. Oh yeah. I've just been like banking videos, experimenting. Like I have so many ideas. Like, okay, give me some dangerous ideas. Uh, I, okay, so I don't know if they're dangerous ideas, but I just feel like if you're not using Hey Gen, like, and you're a content creator so, in so, our space. So just, to, just yeah. to give some people some context, so Hey Gen is a generative AI um, fueled um, platform where you can create, uh, you can create videos in different languages you can create audio you can create avatars um, of yourself so you could recreate yourself and get yourself to say things in like really high quality ways um and so it's been really interesting it's one of the most interesting companies uh they, they've been actually like hey can we repost your, my, your stuff and i'm like yeah yeah absolutely yeah. i love what you're doing man I, so, I i love the company so obviously i'm addicted to the one where you just record a video and you can translate it to like whatever 20 languages so we started experimenting within the lab obviously we're pretty big in china so but i want to test because i'm not i don't know spanish like i don't know hindi that well i'm still learning even mandarin so we take a couple of videos of dev throw it in the hey gen and it spits out these videos one was one minute three minute five minutes. i tested these different lengths so i sent it to our team right and they're like blown away they're like this is literally 90 percent accurate the only thing that's missing is like slang or mannerisms like are thrown off like they're, they're like yo this is 90 percent accurate right now we can post this wow so in my mind i'm just like so you guys posted this in what like wechat or like uh doing doing Douyin, weibo okay. which is like instagram tiktok um basically what it's doing is accelerating again right it's it gives me an idea of like we're having an issue right now where we don't have enough content going on in china um, but also not only does this solve that, it solves the fact that instead of subtitles, it's literally sounds just like dev. Like that's what blew me away. Yeah. It's deep like his voice and it's 90% accurate. I'm like, this is good enough. Let's put it out. So now we're like creating this bank of all the videos, all the training videos, and we're repurposing them as dev genius and Mandarin. Yeah. I, I think the ability to garner a different audience yeah. um, is huge. I've been thinking about this too, um, a lot just for my content and being able to put this out in different languages in Spanish and, yep. and Hindi. My only beef is that um, it doesn't, it doesn't have the, it, it doesn't represent the full sort of feeling and energy. Yeah, I don't know for sure. Right? It's yeah. just content. It's Especially content. with you. Yeah. Because you speak and with a lot of energy and passion. Yeah. So <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So so to me it's like that's what's missing a little mm-hmm. bit. Hey but, Gen 2.0. I'm sure they'll have yeah, just have that. It, 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 and, and I'm sure it will yeah. happen where you can be super expressive. Yep. And you know, I, I've been thinking about like all the ideas around this as well and and just the ability to create, um, like one of the things, I was literally driving here, I was like, how could I use HeyGen 
to just be a video replica of my book. So I did. I, I cre- recorded the audio book of this thing, right? Amazing. Okay. And yeah. and what if I could just use oh, a, instead of me being the on the camera for eight hours, just have the the camera shoot me and or, or just I, I create an avatar and yeah. I'm sort of reading the book and then I put that on YouTube. Do you know what I mean? Yep. Like those are some things that I'm thinking very about. Huh? But I feel like I'm taking um, a very it's a very like it's kind of like when you know when people sh- first shot uh, uh, movies what they did was they they shot like theatrical plays right they they took the thing that they knew and they did that right that's like that's what i'm thinking about right i'm trying what what is what is after this yeah. what is the thing that i'm not thinking about that we can use our 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 voice our video like wh- I, I the there's going to be billion dollar companies built in this space. Maybe it's HeyGen, but there's going to be other There'll companies be built in this space. There will be many of them. Um, and we'll be using those products probably. <laughs> and, and well, yeah. And I love that you are using it. And to me, that shows agency, that, that yeah. shows your ability to take, it's being accountable and it's taking action at the end of the day. Yeah. And if you don't take action, you will be completely irrelevant. Absolutely. I think it's important that like, whether you set aside a day or a couple hours in a week, like so for me every cup every day a couple hours I'm gonna just gonna like kinda of F around. But like I'm gonna like play with Hey Jen or go on chat or whatever. Like I'm gonna do something that's not necessarily like what everyone else is doing. So like today I'm gonna to like write a bunch of emails in ChatGPT, make sure I schedule those in email marketing. I feel like people should set aside a couple hours at minimal just to go like mess around on the internet. You know yeah. what I mean? Because otherwise you're just not gonna get a like you said, the it kinda of, when you first said this, I thought it was lack of urgency. Oh, okay. But I like lack of agency. It's like, you know, it's similar, right? It's like you're just, you need to try th- try things out. Yeah, lack of urgency is definitely a, uh, lack of urgency is definitely a, a dangerous idea, but it's just, that, out of anything, is it's just lack of agency. Like, if you're not going to take action, you are going to be irrelevant. Yep. Like, you could listen to things all day long you could just watch youtube all day long you could li- you can scroll through twitter all day long but if you're not doing anything you are going to be irrelevant totally agree i don't want to get off topic but just quick did you see the guy who's going viral on tiktok for using ai for his interviews with top 500 companies no okay so no tell me okay so there's a guy um what's his name man i wish i could tell you yeah i, I saw someone else repost that buzzfeed or someone posted it um he's going viral he's done all these like big top fortune 500 company interviews live and as they ask him the question on the interview like engineer or whatever the ai is takes literally one second it spits out his entire manuscript and the guy's reading and acing all the interviews oh and getting the i can see this okay asian guy right asian guy, yeah. oh, okay, okay i thought it was okay. incredible man like just the all the things that's coming and it's still so early it's like man this is nuts yeah you know? yeah no 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 kidding i um no, I, I, I think it's uh, I think it's incredible. And, you know, we talk about the next platform shift. This is it. This is Gen AI. And the next content creators that master this mm-hmm. will be the next one. Do you know what I mean? We talked about all these, like, stand-up comedians. Yep. The next one that masters what the, the next Gen AI piece is is going to be the next one. And, hey, it might be us. It might be us. Hopefully it might be us. us. Yeah. Um, I've, I've, been, I've been super passionate about this space. And... It's funny because people are like, are you like a generative AI expert? I'm like, no, I'm not an expert. I'm not an expert at all. But I put in more work than 99.99% yeah, of exactly. any of you guys. So in that respect, in this new realm of generative AI, I guess I put in more work than you. Change your what is an expert at the end of the day, right? That's what we need to ask ourselves. What, an, what is an expert? I don't, what, what is that magical line? That is crossed, right? To where separate you, you. Where you be, like, so what? Are you an expert at something? Like, I'm just. That's a great question. See, that's the thing. Where, where's the line? Are you, like, I would say, are, are you, I would say, I'm an expert in apparel for sure, hundred percent. Okay, was there an imaginary line that you crossed? That that's you a great became, question. Yeah, there, there's not. So, so yeah, I no idea. And and that's <laughs> the thing when it comes to this idea of expertise. There is no, there is no line. Yeah. To me, the line is when you spend ninety nine. If you spend more time than 99.999% of, of the people. planet yep. and putting in the work and showcasing your work, you've now become an expert. Yeah. So in this world of generative AI, I am one of the world's most uh, – because I'm actually trying yeah, everything. You're using it. Posting I'm, it, I'm yeah. using it. Yeah. I'm posting it. I'm trying it. I'm leveraging it. Yep. Um, and 
That's it. 